The Paulding Light, also called the Lights of Paulding is a light that appears in a valley that lies outside of Paulding, Michigan. Reports of the light have appeared since the 1960s, with popular folklore providing such explanations as ghosts, geologic activity, or swamp gas. In 2010, SIFI Channel's Fact or Faked. Paranormal Files conducted a paranormal investigation and concluded that the Paulding light was unexplained. Michigan Tech students conducting a scientific investigation of the light in 2010 were able to see automobile headlights and taillights when viewing the light through a telescope. They recreated the effect of the light by driving a car through a specific stretch of U.S. Highway 45. The story of the Paulding light goes that one night an oncoming train crushed a railroad switchman as he tried to direct the sleeping conductor with his lanterns. Another story claims it's the ghost of a man who was in the woods searching for his son with a lantern and killed by an oncoming train. Regardless, this unexplained orb of light has been appearing for 40 years and remains a mystery. It still appears almost every night. Students from Michigan Tech recently claimed to have debunked the myth calling the phenomenon nothing more than the headlights of cars on a nearby freeway, but believers disagree. The light is a large orb that takes up quite a bit of the horizon. The colors reported range from red to white to green, only one of which is actually the color of headlights. You can check the light out for yourself if you're in the area. Park rangers have even placed signs to show the best spot to view it from. The first recorded sighting of the Paulding light was in 1966 when a group of teenagers reported the light to a local sheriff. Since then, a number of other individuals have reported seeing the mysterious light, which is said to appear nearly every night at the site. Although stories related to the light vary, the most popular legend involves the death of a railroad brakeman. The legend states that the valley once contained railroad tracks and the light is the lantern of the brakeman who was killed while attempting to stop an oncoming train from colliding with railway cars stopped on the tracks. Another story claims the light is the ghost of a slain mail courier, while another says that it is the ghost of an Indian dancing on the power lines that run through the valley. 